we've got four children. Uh, we used to live in Rainbow Beach, mm -hmm. and two years ago, Tristan had a major accident. And um, he was riding his push bike through Rainbow Beach, just coming home after a sleepover at a mate's house, and he was hit mm -hmm. by a car. There were no real thoughts that Tristan would actually pull through the accident. Uh, we were we were told that um, to expect the worst, and um, then after two weeks in ICU, we were actually asked to turn his life support off. But for us, it was never never really an option. It was a matter of no, we have to give him every chance. So we did. And after nearly six months in hospital, he was released, um, still in a sort of vegetative, minimally conscious state. And um, then about a month later, after being released from hospital, it was like a switch turned on and he started making a huge recovery. To go from having your child so severely injured that they may not survive, to not being able to live a life outside of a wheelchair or a bed, to participating in a boot camp, for school camp, it was just amazing. At the start of the camp it was sort of like school, they were a bit standoffish and that unsure of what to do around Trist, but uh, you know, one day in they were coming up and grabbing Trist and wheeling him over when they were playing football or volleyball and just getting him involved. Tristan actually got involved in everything. He wasn't able to do all the activities, but the ones he did, he got fully involved and everyone just like got involved and helped him and everything. While we were in the mud, it took all of us to work together, move Tristan through the on the, the stretcher, because it was fairly deep to be honest, and yeah, it took a few of us to go under and move under the stretcher and keep moving. Once they've got that idea of that mateship and working together to be able to complete the activities, then even some of the harder tasks, like going through the tunnels, uh, became something that they could easily do. Seeing some of the videos and, and photos coming back to us of, of him on camp, we're like, whoa, like, this is amazing, like, covered in mud and just loving it, the kids carrying him. It lifted the stigma. Like, yeah. I guess they all, after Tristan's accident, they all had to get to know him again. Um, so they were all very standoffish and unsure how to approach, how to talk, how to deal. Since then, the mates he has at school now, like, the, everyone's coming up to him you know, all the time, fist bumps, shaking hands, that wasn't there before. Definitely helped me to support other people and put other people in front of myself because, you know, at the end of the day, it's not, it's not always about you, like, that you just need to sacrifice things for other people. And I've definitely matured because of Tristan and having helped Tristan, so 